Hey, wanna see a magic trick? Yeah. Watch this. Apple juice. <laughs> Is that apple juice? On this week's episode of The Real Grill, we're going to do a fantastic recipe for beer can chicken. Stay tuned guys, it's gonna be great. Now for this recipe, we're gonna use a blood orange IPA. The reason why I chose this, this particular beer because of the subtle citrus notes in the beer. It's gonna fumigate and it's gonna allow the chicken to have this beautiful light citrus flavor. Some people say what kind of beer you use doesn't matter, but we like to have a little extra something for our chicken. Blood orange IPA, it's gonna be great. All right, so what you wanna do first is, you wanna take the salt and you wanna take some, put in your hand to control how much you give and just Get the outside, and don't forget to get the inside. Season the chicken all the way around, and rub that salt into the chicken. You're gonna do the same thing with your pepper. Don't forget to get the inside. Paprika. Chipotle roasted garlic seasoning. And then you're just gonna rub them all in. Now when you're now when you're marinating your chicken, make sure you get underneath the skin. You want those flavors to penetrate the flesh and get underneath all underneath in there. So you want you want flavoring 360 all the way around the chicken. Now, for this recipe, you're gonna make sure you have a cup handy for this purpose right here. You're only gonna use about half the beer. And then you're gonna, when you pour it out, you're gonna fill it with your, the same spice you use the made of chicken, you're gonna put in your beer. And you know what they say, don't ever waste any beer. Now the same spices we use for the chicken, we're gonna put in the beer. Not too much though. Oh, it's gonna explode! Salt. I told you! I told you! That's okay. That was supposed to happen. And one little trick I like to do see the ends of the, the wings right here these tend to burn so just fold them back just to keep them tucked in just like that so we're gonna put the chicken set it down right here over the grill now chicken this size ours is five and a half pounds it's gonna take about an hour to an hour and 20 minutes to cook so what we're gonna do is we're gonna close it up just like this and probably in 20 minutes we're gonna check the chicken now make sure you wait the full 20 minutes a chicken this size whole is gonna cook very slowly don't you don't want to open and close all the time because you're gonna lose the heat that's trapped inside the pit so wait 20 minutes come back check it rotate it close it again and we'll check it again later on all right so it's been about 20 minutes we're gonna check it out and see how our chickens going Oh yeah, we're starting to get a great color on there. Wow, so we're just gonna take it, rotate it 90 degrees. Close it up. Yeah, the skin is starting to get nice and crispy. Perfect. Mm -hmm. 
Now one thing about this recipe, the chicken, it takes its time. You got to be patient. As you can see, it's nighttime. My glasses are off because of our lighting issue, but it's a beautiful summer night here out in the Bay Area, and we're gonna make this work. We're gonna enjoy some delicious beer can chicken. So it's been about 15, it's been about 20 minutes. We're gonna check and see how it's looking right now. Oh yes. It's slowly but surely getting there. See the coloration? The skin is, is really, really crispy, guys. Really crispy. And the smell, oh my gosh, it is amazing. Just amazing. So let's give this another 90 degree turn. Look at that color. Color is unbelievable. Oh wow, I cannot wait to dive into this. All right, you guys, so we're gonna give it another about 20 minutes. Check it again. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be epic. As you can see, it's pitch black dark out here, but I think our chicken is done. Let's check it out. Oh, wow. It kind of flipped, fell on its side, but you can see the chicken, the meat is literally falling off the bone, out hot, hot cup. Wow, look at that great color. Yeah, we're about done. So let's go. We're gonna take it, we're gonna serve this on the inside. The skin is so crispy, it's falling apart. Oh man, look at the juices. Oh my gosh, this is going to be delicious. It is literally falling off the bone, you guys. Literally falling off the bone. I can't wait to try this. Let's take it inside so we can serve it up. All right, you guys, moment of truth. Here we go. Let's take this can out first. All the beer's gone. Smells amazing. All right, here we go. Look at this, it's just literally falling off the bone. It's great. Oh, it's amazing. We'll just take some of this right here. Oh yeah, perfect. All the way through. Oh, you can taste the smoke flavor. I can taste the smoke flavor. Mm. You can actually taste the citrus from the beer and the lemon pepper. Remember, we use lemon pepper to get that extra citrus flavor. Mm. This is amazing. Oh. The smoke color on this chicken is unbelievable. Guys, have to try this recipe. It is amazing. It is to die for. Please, go out, light up your grill. It's the summertime. Enjoy your family, good company, great food. It's cheap and expensive, and it's worth it. Get time, sit around the grill, enjoy yourself. Please, don't forget to like our video. Subscribe to our YouTube channels. Follow us on Instagram. Join our Facebook page. We love to have you guys. Stay tuned for the next amazing recipes just like this. Man, it's unbelievable. And I can't wait to crack over another beer. Some beer can chicken. Cheers to me, amigos. Peace.